This is the Art Rage Studio demo. I'm using an optical touch screen. This is the HP Touch Smart. I can use my finger to paint with. I'm not using any pressure as the position of my fingers measured optically. As I run out of paint, it dries out, but it can always reload. with each stroke that I use. Now, uh, as you can see, there's some blending change here. It picks up some of the color of the paint. But if I want real color blending, I could choose that here. Choose another color. And it blends the paint even more. I prefer to use a brush and this is a normal brush that you can buy at any art store or hobby shop and I can still get the same effect as I would using my finger. Now there are three, this is the oil brush tool and there are three new tools that are in this version. One is the watercolor tool and I'm going to put that on a new layer. and make this layer invisible. Now also here I can change the size of the tool. Make that much larger. And as you can see it's picking up some of the color also. A uh, second tool that's available, new tool that's available, is the glue pen. And the third new tool that's available is the ink pen. Now all the tools are located in the left hand side and all the water and all the color is located on the right hand side. And you see that these are small pods that you can expand and I'm going to expand one of the pods now which is the settings. And the settings are available for every tool that's here and I'm also going to expand this pod which is preset. So each tool has a combination of settings and presets that you can use to adapt this to your own painting style. So now let's take a look at the ink pen presets. Let me get a, another layer, create a new layer, make this layer invisible. And now I'm going to draw with the pen tool. And here it is. Uh, and I'm going to draw with the pen tool. And right now it's going around the smooth. And as you saw a little bit of adjustment afterwards, it looked like a jump, but actually it's smoothing the pen tool out. So take care of all the irregularities that my hand has. But you can adjust this so it doesn't have any smoothing and keeps the irregularities that the hand has. So that's the billboard tool. Here's a smooth inking. And this is the technical pen. And this is the thick liner. And finally we have the writing chisel. And again as with all the tools I can adjust the size. Also I can position the canvas. So I can zoom in and out. I can move the canvas left and right. And also I can rotate the canvas. Let me get rid of this preset palette here. Now I can use my fingers to zoom it out. And another thing uh, that Paint Art Rage does is that as my stroke goes toward a palette, it disappears. So this alleviates having to buy a second monitor or using taking time out from drawing and being distracted 
and moving the pallets out of the way. So they're smart enough to move out of the way by, by themselves and to reappear again. Now, another thing I want to show you is that when you open up a new file, a new painting, and we don't want to save that, you can choose the texture of the painting in this little submenu here. So you can choose basic, coarse, fine, special, each one has a submenu that gives you even more basic canvas, basic crumble, basic paper. So you have a lot of options, again, to get it toward the way you like to work. And that concludes our first demo.